In this video, I show you six construction projects in Afghanistan. Goldara District Road Project, Kabul. In the past, the Afghan government started an important project called Goldara District Road Project in Kabul province. This project was dedicated to the improvement and reconstruction of a road in this area from the point where kilometer zero starts to kilometer 213.92 the financing of this project was done through the Afghan government, and its relevant department was the National Rural Road Development Program. The main goal of this project was to rehabilitate and improve the road of Goldara District from zero point to KM 213.5 using asphalt pavement. This road, which started from a place called Goldere in Kabul, was monitored by a team from the National Rural Road Development Program and activities such as construction and asphalting were carried out on it. This project was approved in 2012 and a special plan was considered for its implementation and funding. In this way, with the financial cooperation of the Afghan government, this project was implemented from the beginning to the improvement of the road in Guldara district, and its work was completed, which directly helped to improve the lives of the people of this area. The project of preservation and monitoring of 63 kilometers of Jagli Road from the Karkal Junction to the center of Punjab District, Section 1, Lot 2 inches was started in Punjab District, Bamyan. This project was dedicated to the improvement and maintenance of a road with a length of 63 kilometers and a width of 6 meters in the region. The relevant department of this project was the National Rural Road Construction Program. The project was financed through the World Bank and was approved in 2013 and gradually completed. The main goal of this project was to maintain and take care of the Jagli Road from Karkal Junction to the center of Punjab District, Section 1, Lot 2. These actions include filling and repairing the road sections, resurfacing the road, cleaning the culverts, cleaning and regularizing the lateral grooves of the road, repairing the shoulders on both sides of the road, regularizing the shoulders, repairing the culverts, repairing the crossings, repairing the bridges, and repairing the retaining walls. Was this project, with the cooperation of the World Bank and the financial approval of the Afghan government, helps to improve the performance of the road and the well-being and security of the people of this region. Revitalization Project Bituminization of Doshi to Puel Komri Road Building was started. This project was implemented in Baglan Province and included a 52 kilometers long route from Doshi to Kumri Bridge. The relevant department of this project was the Directorate of Project Regulation. This project was financed by the Afghan government and the year of its budget was 2013 and the project was gradually completed. The main goal of this project was to rehabilitate and tar the building from Sark Doshi to Puel Komri. This road was part of the Ring Road of Afghanistan and connected the northern provinces of the country to the capital of Afghanistan by crossing the Salang Pass. This route attracts less than half of the country's population for commuting. The importance of this route is in terms of economic and agricultural growth in the country, and it is considered as a vital route. Also, it is important for minerals. Karkar coal of Baglan province is transported to neighboring districts and provinces through this route. The construction project of the Besud Bridge and Tuzandarme and Hoda Farm Bridges was started in Nangarhar province. This project was implemented in Besud region and was under the supervision of the Directorate of Project Regulation. Besud Bridge, which passes through Besud Kuzkanar and Daranur districts in Nangarhar province, was built with a length of 39 meters and a width of 8 meters. This project was financed by the Afghan government and the year of its budget was 2013. The main goal of this project is to establish a direct connection between these districts with the center of the province and the city of Jalalabad. This bridge provides government employees, students, businessmen, and other residents of these areas with the possibility of commuting to Jalalabad city. In addition, the residents of Kunar and Nuristan provinces also go to Nangarhar center and the country's capital by crossing this bridge. This bridge also played an important role in the transportation of minerals such as sea gravel and construction stones of the district and improved the living conditions of the local people, 
facilitating local interactions and the economic growth of the region. The project of construction of roads inside the city of Cherikar was implemented in Parwan province. This project was supervised by the Directorate of Projects and deals with urban development and traffic reduction in Cherikar. The construction of the provincial roads was done by providing the asphalting process with a length of 24 kilometers and a width of 8 meters. This project was financed by the government of Afghanistan and the year of its budget was 2013. The main goal of this project was urban development and by providing regional and local connections, improving the environment and facilitating the provision of health, educational and urban services to the residents of Charikar. This project is known as a successful effort to improve the daily life and urban conditions of the common people of Charikar. The 50 kilometer long Sharnangur Hidayat project was started in Paksha province. This project was supervised by the relevant department, the PMO, and with the aim of improving connections and economic development of the region, the construction and installation of asphalt roads with a width of 10 meters and a total length of 50 kilometers took place. This project was financed by the Asian Development Bank and the year of its budget was 2014 and it was gradually completed. This project is divided into two parts. The first section, with a length of 23 kilometers, included five bridges of different lengths and sizes, 83 culverts of various sizes, five crossings, and retaining walls. The second section, with a length of 27 kilometers, has three bridges, 80 culverts, three crossings, and retaining walls. This highway passes through the districts of Barmel, Gomel, Sar Rosa, Sarubi, and Ergon. The importance of this project lies in increasing the economic growth and improving the communication of the southern region of the country with Pakistan. After the completion of this project, many positive effects were created in people's daily life, improving the economic situation, improving health services, education, and other regional affairs. The government of Afghanistan, by starting projects such as Goldara Kabul District Road Project, Jagli Road 63 kilometers Maintenance and Care Project and Doshi Pool Komri Road Revitalization Project is trying to improve and rebuild the road and building infrastructure in it had different provinces. These projects with the financial cooperation of the government and international organizations such as the World Bank not only sought economic and safety improvements in the targeted areas, but also helped to improve people's daily lives and upgrade the level of infrastructure and regional connections. These efforts played a significant role in the direction of sustainable development and improvement of the living conditions of the local population, and were of significant importance in promoting communication and the economic growth of different regions of Afghanistan. Thank you for watching.